Hello everyone, I am Tessellating Hexagons, and I'm back with some more Eversion, and might as well start the title screen because... Uh, there's a level select. You know, it's not like one of those old games where you have to play through the game in order to get to the next level, which actually made Sonic 3D Versus a bit of a nightmare, but whatever. Anyway, uh, I've completely forgotten the controls since last time. Uh, anyway, yeah. We went in World 2, and... That's that's a Goomba. Well, actually, no, they're called Gulibas. I looked it up. Um, like, like, as in the Japanese name for Goomba plus the Arabic word for ghost, I think, maybe? Now, let's not be stupid. We're in World 1. Well, Level 2, World 1. That's how I'll, that's the nomenclature I will use. So, those clouds look like platforms, but they're not solid objects. So, we can't stand on them, we'll fall to our dooms and die in that order. No, <laughs> we'll die and then fall to our doom because we won't already be dead. I'm in a weird mood. Then again, I, know, I was going to record this about 15 minutes sooner, but I was waiting for my headphones to charge. <coughs> really? I was waiting for my headphones to charge, and then, like, while I was doing that, I played some Animal Crossing, and then, like, within about two minutes of me starting the game, um, Animal, well, my headphones finished charging, but I was just sat there playing Animal Crossing, and so I just thought, well, you know, my town needs tending to. <coughs> really? Wow. I'm just not on point today. <coughs> what? Oh, excuse me while I laugh like a door. Oh, come on! This is getting silly. Like, clearly I'm going to need to get good. Because, as I've mentioned in the past, the platforming in this game does get pretty difficult later down the line. Of course, that there's the obligatory auto-scrolling level or two, so... Like I said, I'm going to need to get good in advance of that, because not only is it auto-scrolling, but, I mean, there's gems to collect as well. Uh, now, there's a bush there. And, oh, there's an aversion point up there, because, like, you, you can press the avert button to see where nearby aversion points are. I think that's what they're called, anyway. But we can't go through these bushes because they're solid objects, so... Can't go any further this way, either, because... The clouds aren't solid objects, so we'll just have to go one layer deeper. Go back into World 2, where everything's a bit less in-your-face. Polysaccharin... Oh, we still can't go through these bushes, though. So... Well, what does that mean? Ah, don't think I can go back that way because the clouds will... Cloud block me? It's like cock blocking without a penis? Whoa! Not appropriate for a game like this. Boop. Now, I don't think I mentioned in the last episode, but I certainly did like the the video description and the, um... Oh, look, there's another reversion point. But we don't want to go back to the, the first layer, because that'll just... Well, we're trapped in here anyway. Ooh. Oh, we're in, a, we're in a third layer. Looks a bit gloomy, but I don't know. Not everything could be... <laughs> Wow. Not everything can be all happy and sparkly, I suppose. But, um, yeah, I mentioned in the video description and the playlist description of the... of this series, that, um, that this... the whole purpose of the game is ZT the asterisk is going on a quest to rescue Princess Nehema because she's been kidnapped. Just a classic story. Except we're playing as an asterisk with the power to turn the world inside out. So, there, there's that. Those blocks look mildly pissed off, but then again, I mean, you know, that the, there are holes in the mountains, the, the hills don't look quite right, you know, the, the clouds, the, that's what I literally just said, the clouds are being held up by strings, wow. The, yeah, the clouds are being held up in the, um, in the first layer as well, but still. I don't think... Oh, we can get back this way, we just need to bounce on the Guliba's head. Can I help you? Can I help you? This is a random V up there. I actually legitimately don't know what that is, because I think this game's had several updates, I'd say over the years, but across the course of an unspecified amount of time, and I, like, that, that that letter mechanic, I think, is something that's been, wow, I should have jumped and I didn't, I think that's something that's been added, but I'm going to go back and check what that was, because I, I, I it feels like a collectible, and I'm going to try and collect it. So, can I have this V? I got the V! Whatever that means. I get the feeling that there was probably like, like, but since this is the second level, and uh, V is the second letter in Evert or Eversion or Ev something, so maybe there's an E in the first level. So, <laughs> wow. Maybe there's an E in the first level I could go back and look for. And as you may have noticed in in the first level, I've been keeping a. A, a death counter, just because, as I said, this game can get a bit devious with its platforming, so... 
you know, just just for shits and giggles, I'm gonna see how many times I can fail, but that's the end of World 2, Level 2, whatever. So, as usual, well, that didn't actually take me all that long, so I, I won't sign out just yet. Um, not gonna spoil what the next level looks like. Yeah, th th there's now that V in the top corner, so I'm gonna have a look through the first world, see if they're, well, the first level, whatever. So, of course, you recognise this area, this is obviously level one, we did this in the last episode, but just to make sure that this, that this place, this, uh, bleh, this episode, is what I'm trying to say, isn't too short, I'm gonna go back and see if I can find, because, I don't know, I, I, you would have thought, if there was like a hidden letter or something, I would have seen it in the, in the recording of the first episode, but I, I don't know, I didn't know to look for it. So I'm gonna go back this way, because, like, if there are these hidden collectibles, this looks like a sensible place to hide it. Sure enough, wow. Like, that, legitimately, I did not know that that was there, that was just an educated guess. So, <laughs> you get two levels for the price of one, but unfortunately it's one that we've already done, if I can make this jump. So, you know, let me know in the comments if you're enjoying this game. I mean, admittedly, Layer 3, World 3, whatever you want to call it. I just double averted. <laughs> like... If this is the first, like, I'll refresh them as layers and the levels as levels, so we don't have to worry about the word world, I think. But let me know how, what you think of this game, what you think is waiting in the deeper version layers, and if you've played the game before, don't spoil it, because, you know, I want it to be a bit of a, a surprise for people who haven't played it before to see what these other worlds are like, or Eversion layers, or whatever. So, yep, sure enough, I'm guessing it spells either Evert or... You can see in the top right corner it says EV, and like, I didn't know there were collectible letters, but that's what I'm going to go for in this playthrough. I did not know they were there. Like, I literally learned this on this recording right now, so... I'm going to try and get all of them. I have no idea what that will accomplish, but I'm going to go for it. If there's not an achievement for it, I will be very sad. But, anyway, my thoughts have been all over the place, but, yeah. So, if you're enjoying this game, let me know. And if you know what happens in the end, don't spoil it, because I want it to be a nice little surprise for people watching. And, well, I have been in Booker to be tessellating hexagons, and in the next episode... Well, who knows? Maybe we'll go, we'll, we'll go back to layer three and see what awaits us on the the horror plane. Because we've got the the sugar level, we've got the neutral level, we've got the horror level. Like, what what else could there be? You know, feel free to speculate if you don't already know. But please don't spoil it because this game is best played without spoilers. So, see you in the next one.